ZSK TA2 controller. This video is intended to be a reference guide. I will show you now how to convert a DST file to Z file. Simply, I have inserted a USB stick in the back of the controller. I will now open the design hitting the R1 button, selecting the USB, letting it default to any frame of pantograph. I will select my design. I will assign it a new number. I will also let the system select the free design version. I will also rename my design. In this case, it will be ZSKDST. Hit OK. I will now confirm the setup of the naming of my file. The next screen we come to, we need to select Optimize with User Defined Values. You notice here is the first time is the design over here. And over here you see several stops in the major functions of the design itself. We will now select Auto Assignment. We will hit Needle 1, 2, 3 button. You notice the Stop button has now changed over here to Needles. And you also notice that the design has changed to three colors. We will hit Accept Stop Table. We will also accept Optimize with Set Values. The next screen here is the modification screen. Here we have the capabilities of rotating design with one button or any angle we wish. For our demonstration purposes we're going to select no design modification. Here for the first time now you will see the digitizers, the needle colors corresponding to the design itself. In addition on the right hand side the major code you'll see one foreign code adapted. Confirmation that the design has been converted we hit accept loaded design. Next screen we come to we're going to assign our needles with the proper color it was digitized. The digitizer hit needle number one in blue and in my case that is eight. Red in my case is seven and green is twelve and I will hit confirm. We have now done major setup with the design. We are actually ready to embroider but before we do so I highly recommend that you always hit the range button and you can contour slower or faster or contour finer. This will give the exact outline of your design on your material. By hitting the green button it will now walk through this design and show you on the material in the pantograph hoop where the design will fall. I will hit previous. We are now ready to hit the green button on the controller to embroider our design. This is how we convert a DST to Z file. If you do this several times it should take you no longer than 15-20 seconds to do. Thank you for your time, hope this was helpful and hope to see you soon again with some other helpful hints.